Hi, welcome again to Inside with Streetside. This is where we give you an insight on how we build your home. And right now, we're at chapter two. Chapter two is our framing, our superstructure as we call it. Um, so this right here, uh, building three, we'll take you inside and give you a little insight as to how it looks before we close all your walls up. Welcome to inside your home. Uh, framing stage right now, so we're just going to show you a couple of things here. So obviously we've got open walls, uh, no roughens have happened at this point. Um, so we're just basically completed our framing inspection. Uh, framing inspection is where we identify mistakes or deficiencies and we correct them before we move on to the next part, which is roughens. Uh, as you can see, there's orange markings here. So these highlights right here are for our framers to understand what we want them to adjust and then they come back and fix it and we reinspect again and make sure that we're ready for the next move. So let's take you upstairs. So we're on the upper floor right now and we're looking at uh, a complete open structure. We have the trusses up here um, all open and ready for, for roughens. Before we do roughens, we're going to do a minor fire rating. Uh, this is where we complete a fire separation between the two dwellings. Um, and then essentially the first thing that comes in obviously is the tub because it is fairly large. And after our framing inspection is complete and approved, then we will move on to the roughens. Okay, so we've gone through the framing stage. This is all before the drywall. I'm just going to show you some um, drawings on the floor here. Hopefully this is the, uh, the only time that you'll have drawings all over your floor. This is what we use to set out for all our heating, all our plumbing. Um, this is just really good for us to be able to look at, look at the floor and see what's going up here. So this is all set out for roughings, and obviously HVAC, and then we've got plumbing, and then also here we have a lot of the, uh, the return airs, all the different things that we need to indicate just before the trades come in and get ready for drywall. So we've talked about the overall structure and superstructure, um, but basically we prefab all the walls on site. So our framers, when they have a downtime, they prefab the walls for a future building, and uh, then they pretty much put them up like Legos. So we give them a proper uh, floor to start on and then they erect all the perimeter walls essentially and after that all the interior walls go up and then we start joisting is what we call it. So those are your, your floors. Um, and then they just go up pretty much a week and a half to two weeks per floor. Section. 